king And the apes climbed down from the trees And grew tall and they started talking And the stars fell out of the sky And the tears rolled into the ocean And now I'm looking for a reason why You even set my world into motion Cause if you're not music as well. We're going to 90 degrees.
Hey, I'm here with uh, Ruth, uh, soul singer, here today at 90 Degrees. She just performed four amazing songs. Uh, Thank you. Nice to meet you, also. <laughs> um, just to, you know, discuss perhaps a bit of Motown. I mean, how did you get into the genre? And, um, you know, who, what influences do you have? Favourite artists, perhaps? Um, it's, some, it's the sort of music that I've always enjoyed. The sort of music that my mum always used to listen to and have playing. And, well, Motown, soul, jazz sort of things. Uh, my main influence has really been more on jazz. I sort of Ella Fitzgerald, me and the Simone kind of thing. But in terms of the Motown, I've always been a big fan of like Marvin Gaye, Stevie Wonder. It's an absolute icon to me. So, yeah, just through that really. But how do you feel like perhaps, uh, you know, the Motown being here at 90 degrees, uh, you know, obviously it has a wide appeal. But um, how's it going to bring people in? I and mean, what does it offer that's different to say just over the road, perhaps? I think it's absolutely fantastic because it's a type of music that just can bring so many different people together, as opposed to where you've got your average nightclub, which is either playing the chart stuff or more dance music. That's just so specific. It has such a specific target audience. Whereas indeed, indeed. Motown is just music that's timeless, and so it can bring in. Well, I've got like my mum here, and then I've got all my friends here, and then I've got older friends of my mum's here yes. who are absolutely love the music and now you're getting new artists that are staying within the genre such as Amy Winehouse, Mark Ronson using sort of similar style of song, similar yes. instrumentation and so I think it's fantastic. <laughs> Degrees. Steph's just performed um, on stage. Absolutely amazing, fantastic you. young talent. Uh, just discuss to us and perhaps you know identify how did you get into Motown? What, what do you like about Motown? Well, Motown is probably the oldest kind of music that I got into, apart from jazz, things like Ray Charles. And then after Ray Charles, obviously Motown was influenced by him. So it all kind of goes up the chain up to like R and B music today. So. Yeah. People like Aretha Franklin, my mum like loves Motown, all my aunties, and I come from a black family, so again, it's like the biggest influence. Sure, of course. So, Marvin Gaye, Jackson 5, Aretha Franklin, just from when I was tiny, absolutely tiny. Michael Jackson, I think, Dangerous was the first album I ever had when I was like two. Amazing. And um, so, ever since then. Oh, obviously, like Motown's like highly stylized and highly choreographed. How do you feel that like 90 Degrees has catered and made it a pretty good atmosphere for oh, obviously brilliant. the Motown Abs annual Motown? Yeah, event. absolutely brilliant. I mean, they it's, it's a good place to perform. I love Definitely. performing here. I've done loads of different gigs here, and Motown's my favorite. Also, with a live band. Yes. With a live band, that's 
best you can possibly do. What did you do? What did you say? Or did you walk or did you run away? Where are you now? Where have you been? Did you go alone or did you bring a friend? I need to know this cause I know this You're smiling out of the sun Having fun and feeling free And I can tell you know how hard this life can be But you keep on smiling for me
take you long Was knowing your weakness what made you strong Or all the above, oh how I love to see you Oh, see. So, so, so. 